Oh, what's going on, everybody? Here, welcome back to some more Hydra. Here today, we're continuing our adventure into Volcalidus. I'm still, I'm gonna mess that up forever. Uh, Volcalidus. So we got lots of snow, lots of things, lots to do. We got our first little mine set up here, and uh, yeah, it's uh, what? What is this? East? East something? Oh, this is dawn rest. I don't know why I was thinking it was east something. Uh, but yeah, so we need to go ahead and uh, we need to get things just going and continuing on. So um, I'm going to go ahead and buy the first thing we're going to do is we're going to let this run because we're not going to make it money just sitting here. Um, and then the other thing is somebody commented and said that if you use lava, lava will actually melt the snow and uh, it'll like it'll melt it, but like it destroys it. So like. Oh, it, it only did a little bit. <laughs> I was thinking it was going to melt like all the way down to the, I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> oh my gosh. Tis my life. Tis my life. Um, but yeah, so we're going to continue on where we left off. We're going to let this thing run for a little bit. We basically just get this going. So, uh, I do apologize if I sound different, if I sound terrible, I am, I just got over an ear infection and now I have a killer throat ache. It is, it's just insane. So it's just, I, you know, I just, my life, it's just one thing after another, after another. So, um, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and let this run for a little bit. We'll take this to town and then we'll see what we can do with that. All right. So I've been letting this run for a little bit here. Now, I think what we're going to do is we're going to scale up here a little bit. Um, let's go ahead and turn this bad boy off. And then what we're going to do is we're going to take this, sell this. And then I think what we're going to do is in order to like just increase productivity, we're going to get three more of uh, we're going to get two more. We're going to get two more of these guys. We're going to put one here and one here. So we'll have three machines going into this one. So hopefully that will um, that'll increase our profits a little bit. So I need enough to make three machines and then connect it up. But I don't think we're going to have that off of this one. But we'll go take this one in and we'll see. Uh, we'll see what we can do here. Actually, you know what? I need to fill up the we need to fill up the lava. <laughs> I'm still not sure how I'm supposed to get the lava. Oh, okay. I guess it doesn't. I was worried about it sinking under under the lava and not being able to see it. You know, because like the water, you can you can see it, right? But lava, it's like, it's not opaque. <laughs> like, uh, did I get any? There it is. Okay, cool. Oh, this is so neat. I think this is super cool. So, what do you guys think of the update so far? Are you are you enjoying? Are you playing? Are you waiting? Like, what's what's the deal? What's what's going on? I'm curious because I'm having so far. I'm having a good time. I'm definitely curious to see what the later machines offer. Wow, these trucks are like, these trucks really get up and go, don't they? Get up and go, gone up and went. <laughs> All right, Mr. Seller man, we got them some things to sell here. How much do we have? We probably don't have that much. Last time we had like 200. Uh -oh, 850, let's go, that's awesome. Okay, cool. That might actually be enough for another, um, another drill that's that's actually quite cool now um uh, one thing i have been thinking about and it was, it, i don't know yet because i haven't got to the point is uh, the belts require water which i know we need a snow melter in order to in order to get water but where do you get the snow and is there an infinite like source of snow because i know it's snowing you know like it's it's snowing like actively so like it's do we collect snow from that or you know what i mean i'm just kind of curious so i mean maybe there's a drill thing that harvests snow and, or maybe, I don't, you know what? I don't know. I have no idea, but let's get to the other town. Let's go see if we can, uh, can grab anything. You know what? Let's also find, uh, let's find four more bones to take with us. So we can get the thousand hydro explorer coins, which I still don't even know what we do with those. But, uh, I, you know, I want them, you know, if I can have a thousand of some special coin, I, I want it. Okay. So we have two, I need two more. So what we're going to do is we're going to, we're going to follow we're gonna look over here as we go there's one i can see one over here in the distance let's go grab that okay i just need one more we're gonna go over this way there's gotta be one more just laying around here somewhere i haven't looked over here very much so i wonder if there's any like out in the lava area oh i see one way over there okay we'll go grab that one i see you hiding here mr sneaky sneaky hydrosaur rib Looks like we got all ribs right now. <laughs> Anybody hungry for a hydrosaur rib snack? All right, let's go to the museum. And we'll turn our bones in and then we'll get whatever whatever coins there. I don't know what. Hello, hello there. We'll see what these coins are used for. I guess a guy could have parked his uh, 
his hydro truck or lava truck a little bit closer so he didn't have to run quite as far back and forth but you know what that's fine exercise is good for us maybe not so much in a video game but it doesn't matter all right so there's that so now i need to grab the uh the scroll let's see where's our scroll at is it this one it's this one 12 of 12 fossils he's gonna want like 100 next time is he gonna want like 100 or like 25 or something i don't even know hello i got you bones i did i put the bones in the box thank you currency a scout guild used to buy things combine by dropping other split <laughs> used to buy things that helps a lot okay so it's a snowflake coin <laughs> snowflake coin all right stick those together and what is his what is his next goal uh is it gonna be something reasonable like 25 or is it gonna be like 100 oh it's 24 that's completely reasonable i'm just gonna leave him i'm gonna let him hold on to that because i'll lose it <laughs> uh and then let's go see how much our things are over here how much are these so we have 800 <gasps> why are these two chained up oh i'm only allowed to get two yo that's not nice that's not nice. Um, tier one storage, tier one store construction crate. It's only 50 coins. You know what? I think it might be time to build our first store. Hold on. You know what? We're actually going to leave this one here. Let's buy our tier one crate, our store first. Oh no, it's empty. <laughs> and then let's go see what we can get from there. Because maybe we can get better versions of these you know what i mean because like this one is i don't even know i can't even see it now all right so let's buy that okay so where do we put our tier one store tier one store i want it close so i guess right here hello there tier one store used to can draw me in an empty construction site to begin there it is requirements oh no Hardstone block and iron bar. <laughs> we have to build the stuff. <laughs> oh, we could sell. Oh, we can't quite sell raw materials here. Okay, because there's no jewelry. All right, all right, all right. We're going to grab the other thing. <laughs> so I can only have one more of these. I mean, that's fine. That's fine. We'll just set that there and then go ahead and purchase that. So we can only get another. Wow. Okay. Now I'm gonna have to uh gonna think I'm gonna have to think about how we have to have this hooked up. Okay, so just give give me a second here. I gotta visualize. Okay, I think I figured it out. I think I need a T, an elbow, and an elbow. Oh, <laughs> uh, let's see. How far off am I going to be? I need a T and an elbow and an elbow. T elbow. I think that's all I need. Okay, and then how many coins do I have left? I have 398. Okay. Should we go ahead and get another lava filter? Let's get another lava filter. And then 398. Actually, maybe we should start getting the stuff to make stuff, huh? Because if I start um, hand sorter. You know what? Let's just get this stuff. We'll take this. We'll get this stuff made. We'll take another load. We, yeah, well, we got We got this. We got this. We got we to gotta make, make strides. You know what I mean? We can't just do everything at once. You can't just start off by by automating an entire thing? Like, what are you talking about? Okay, so we're back on our plot. Uh, also, I wanna, I wanna mention, I, I thought about something after my last video. Uh, it doesn't really matter, the, the snow we were moving, remember how I dug, dug this hole and I was like, oh, the deeper snow, you know, give us better stuff. So if we know anything from the dirt, uh, tier one dirt looks the same and all acts the same until you hit tier two. And tier two dirt is different than tier, than, uh, than than tier one dirt so i imagine the snow until i hit actually tier two snow it's not gonna make any difference whatsoever and i doubt that i hit tier two snow by just digging that little hole because i probably needed a better i probably needed better equipment anyways in order to make that happen so um okay there we go so that's gonna go like that oh i might have been i might have been off a little bit here okay so um, let's see here. I need the T and then, okay. Yep. I needed one straight, but I actually have an extra straight one. So oh, I was lucky. Let's pretend. All right. And then one last pipe right there. 
So that should give us, that's gonna double our production. And then hold on, let's get our filter hook on here. Trying to get the filter hooks on here because I mean, you know, they make a difference. So there's another filter hook, we got those. That all looks fine and dandy. And then we need our, we need our bucket here. All right, so um, we need to make enough money in order to get, well, I guess I didn't need those anyway. So I was like, wait, oops. Uh, we need to make enough money in order to get our equipment now. So let's go ahead and turn this back on. It's on the right spot. How about there? No, not quite. There? Too close. Mm, almost. How about there? Eh, it looks about right. Perfect. Okay. So now we have double the resources coming out here, which is wonderful. Absolutely fantastic. So I'm going to go ahead and let this run for a little bit. We'll go over, we'll sell some stuff for Pete, and then we'll go buy some new stuff. Let me go ahead and drop this off over here um and then we'll go buy some of this so what we need to do is we need to actually get so we'll probably end up buying a tea on this for this guy right here and then putting our um sorter deal thing coming off of this one because it, it does require um some water so we're gonna need or some lava power so we're gonna need a sorter and then uh we need the crucible we need all that stuff we need the anvil and um, it probably wouldn't also be a bad idea to have um, some foundations in here so that way we can like actually start, you know, getting some something like decent set up so it doesn't look so terrible. Um, yeah, so we'll get that going. But I'm gonna go ahead and let this run just for a little bit. I'm gonna let it run for, um, you know, I'm gonna give it half an hour. I'm gonna give it 30 full minutes and hopefully it doesn't break. If it breaks before then, then we'll, <laughs> then we'll, uh, we'll stop before that. So uh, I'll try to keep uh, a timer going here and we'll see, we'll see how long this goes for. All right, so I didn't wait the 30 minutes. I couldn't wait the 30 minutes. And then I forgot I stopped recording and it's just, it's, you know what? It's just, this is things how we're working out today. It's just been a day. So what happened was I waited 15 minutes. We got 2,800 coins, which was amazing. Um, it, felt, it felt pretty good for, for only like 15 minutes. And then uh, basically we're spending our coins. So we're getting some stuff set up here. Nothing super crazy you missed. I just sold the, I just sold what we had over there. So, um, okay, let's take this stuff. Actually, you know what? I need to take this stuff closer. I want to go ahead and start setting up um, the, the stuff that we're going to need for refining. So we've got a crucible. I'm going to go ahead and just drop all this stuff out here because I just don't, I'm going to, we're going to set it up here in a second. Um, let's see, grab all of those. I got a couple more pans because I feel like we need pans so we can keep this running whilst we're, uh, whilst we're gone. There we go. Let it do its thing. And then we got another pan because like eventually we're going to have to start sorting like, oh, you know what? Let's leave this in here. We're gonna have to start sorting the, um, you know, our, our crystals and our gems and stuff like that. So yeah, all kinds of fun stuff. All right, everything is out of the truck. Let's go ahead and let's get some foundations. I wanna go ahead and get some foundations. I wanna get some things organized up. I don't want everything just sitting on the ground looking terrible. All right, I got some foundations in the back here. Hopefully they all ride. They're all like intermingling with each other. That's fine. Um, I also, so I grabbed like, I think I grabbed five foundations and I also grabbed a bag of wrenches as well. So that way we can start fixing stuff as needed. Um, but yeah, hopefully these foundations, we'll start with these foundations, kind of see what we can, see what we need, see what we can get laid out here and get some things organized up. Cause I mean, we've, we've got a factory started. Like we got two, two machines. Okay. So I'm thinking that our area that we're going to be using, what the heck is going on here? There we go. I think the area we're going to be utilizing is going to be like right in here because we're going to need, we're going to need water hookups. So I want to make sure that we're close enough to our, uh, our lava. <laughs> we're going to need lava hookups. So I want to make sure we're close enough to our lava source. Let's see. Oh, this is going to be so nice. This is going to be so nice and fancy. I should have grabbed another one. I'm going to put that one there. We're going to grab this guy, move that, grab this guy, put this right there. Okay. Uh Oh, Oh, it's because it's broken. Hey, it's a good thing that we got the um, our bag of wrenches. One bag of wrenches. Look at this. And boop. Good to go. All right. So now, Crucible. Get that place there. Oh, gosh. This is what's going to be fun here. So we're going to have to set these down. And we're gonna have to, we need that gems, we need that sorter, the hand sorter, in order to make this whole system like work. So we'll put that there, okay. And then let's go get, let's go grab that hand sorter and kind of see what's going on with it. That's doing its thing, we'll leave it alone. Um, was the hand sorter at the other place? I, I think it was. 
Okay, so let's see. Yeah, here it is. Hand sorter. Okay, so that's lava powered. Now, in order to make that happen, how does this work? Okay, so the lava goes in there. Okay, so lava goes in there. I'm trying to decide if I want... I feel like we're just going to be using these anyway. So that goes in there. So we're going to need another... <gasps> oh, no, there's no pipes. Oh, yes, there's. Okay, I was like, there's no pipes here. All right, so we're going to need a T-pipe. Um, and then we're also going to need a straight pipe, I think. I'm going to grab an extra straight pipe just in case. Okay, so we've got that. Bed logic. Oh, there's a gem compressor. I still don't know what that is exactly. Hmm. Hardstone refiner. Refines hardstone into usable blocks. Fills with hardstone until the logic value is met. You know what? Let's grab this. Okay, hold on. So let me look here. Okay, so if this is... Where's the output of this? Okay, so the lava's gonna have to go in here. So if I place this one like this... If I placed a T in here between them, I could use this and this maybe, and then we'd have to use... Um, this logic deal. Yeah, but do I need to be on this side of it to place it in there? I don't know. I'm a little, I'm a little confused. I'm a little confuzzled here. We don't have any, we don't have any logic. Uh, no, we don't, darn, okay. And then, hmm. Maybe I should just get a, a lever instead. No, nah, we'll do this, we'll do that, okay. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see what happens here. Uh, I could probably use the magnet on stick. I could probably use a funnel too, but we'll just grab this stuff and head out. Wait, hold on, okay, hold on. So, T-pipe, straight pipe. Let's say straight pipe, straight pipe, corner, boop. And then another T-pipe. Okay, we need one more T-pipe. I think. There we go. We still have money. We still have money left. Oh my gosh. I'm wondering if the hard stone is a, um, is it gonna make like a concrete block for me or something? I don't know. Okay, so, you know, I didn't buy the elbow, but we have an extra elbow right there. Okay, oh, oh, hello. Everything has stopped. Everything has stopped. All right, filter's broken. Let's go ahead and shut that down. Oh, I forgot when the filters break, it stops everything. Uh, let me grab this. Isn't it? It's that guy. Ta-da! Okay, cool. So, oh shoot, I should have grabbed another foundation. We're gonna put it right here. Because we're gonna need this guy. So we're gonna have it hook like... Because we're gonna have a pipe come out from here. So it's gonna hook up right there, and then we're gonna have this right there. And then let's see what we got here. We got a T-pipe, okay, cool. T-pipe's gonna go there. We're gonna grab our elbow. That's gonna go there, and then we're gonna have to have a couple straight pipes and then another T. Oh yes, everything is looking magnificent. Things are connecting very well, I gotta say. We're, we're doing the stuff. All right, where's our T-pipe at? Yeah, look at that, perfect, exactly what I needed. Now we have one, should have one extra straight pipe. Yep. All right, let's see. How do I get you? There we go, and boom. Okay, so that should do that. And then as far as this thing goes, I guess what we'll do is we got to put a logic in here of something. Okay, so we'll do that. And then I guess what we'll do is we'll do a logic of 10. I guess that's a, that was what was already there. Okay. I don't exactly know what this does. <laughs> to be completely honest here, I'm not, I'm not 100% sure. So what we're going to want is we're going to want something. We're going to want a pan here. I need more. I need more foundations is what I really need here. No, nope, let's put these back. Okay, you know what? You just, they can go right there. Okay. And then we're gonna drop this one down in there. Oh God. I have a feeling I'm about to make a huge mess. Uh, you know what? Let's do this instead. Let me move this. And then can this, will this crucible fit right here? It's close. No, that's not gonna work. All right. Okay, so we'll put that there, we'll put that there. Now let's say, let's do the hardstone first maybe? Is this hardstone? Okay, so let's put the hardstone on here. 
And I want to see what the Hearthstone does, you know, because I really have no idea. So, oh, shoot. We're going to need a... I need another one of these. Pans. You know what? We'll just, we'll just set this right here, I think. That'll work. Okay. So let's turn this bad boy on. It's going to get those going. That's going to do that thing. Are we making it into there? Not really. It's fine. We'll figure it out later. <laughs> okay. So this is powered. Oh, God. I'm so scared to do this. Um, well, that ejected out way, way, way further than I had thought it was going to. <laughs> you see that? It was like a huge ejecto. Um, okay. So now what happens if we grab, okay, so let's grab this. I'm going to grab all these pieces and put them in here. I don't know how, I don't really know how we're going to dump this in. We also, I also realized we need a, we need a magnet stick. Okay. So what, how does this thing work? Okay, so it made a block of hardstone. A block of hardstone. Okay. Interesting. So it's a whole it's it's just a whole separate thing. Okay. Very interesting indeed. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. We need to turn this down. We need to, we need to turn this off. This is we're not we're not currently functioning in the the way that I'd like to be functioning here. So Oh God. Oh, that's right. It will only gather one. Well, you know what? Since we're already here, let's just smelt that bad boy up. Um, this needs a little bit of a redesign here. So what we need is we actually need probably a foundation above here. So it, it hits it and then falls straight down, falls straight down into one of these, I think. Um, oh, you know what? I need the mold. I guess let's grab that. Set that there. Is it liquefied? Yes, it is. Very nice. And boop. Oh my God, it's a teeny tiny little bar. Look at how tiny that thing is. Oh, it's so adorable. This, this is so adorable. <laughs> okay. We need more stuff. Let's go grab some more stuff. So I was actually thinking, I was like, you know what? That hand sorter, it really shot out the material. And then the, like, the rest of it went that way. So actually, if you had these stairs stepped up, you could, in theory, sort all of the different resources and then have them shoot out and have them go into find better prices than these. and have them go fall like directly into cauldrons on these. You know what I mean? Like there's 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 the there's an attempt for some automation here. Now, is it worth going through all that automation just for this phase? I don't think so. And the reason I don't think so is because it seems like the re the the requirements for building that tier one re the, the tier one shop or whatever wasn't that bad. So, yeah, I don't think it's I don't think it's worth it. But um, it could definitely it could definitely be a thing. It could have absolutely happen. Okay, so we're gonna grab one of those, and I'm gonna grab a couple of these small guys because I think we're gonna use these to help um, divert resources to certain like when it shoots out of that thing. So it goes to certain places, hopefully. I'm also gonna grab a funnel. Okay, we're gonna grab that stuff. I think, is that everything that we need right now? Hmm. We have this so we could weigh stuff, but we don't really need to weigh stuff because we're right now we're just kind of trying to sell everything. So I think we're good. Let's go ahead and load this stuff up. Okay, so let's see here. Oh, I, you know what? I needed more pans too. I forgot. All right, let's go ahead and pick this up real quick. And let's clean, <laughs> let's clean up our mess a little bit before we do anything else. Zerp and in there and in there perfect okay so that all looks good now this thing right here let's see here um it, it literally ejected everything up to right there which is fine i have no issue with that whatsoever um let me go and place this right here temporarily but what i want to do is i want to make it so that way if it's going to do that it at least lands somewhere useful you know what i mean Okay, so if it goes, it would hit this, and in theory, it should fall straight on the, into into this area, <laughs> this area right here. Um, maybe <laughs> I say that. Um, now, if I if I could, I don't think it's gonna make it over that. I think it's gonna hit this. 
And if I lower it by one, it's gonna take up a whole spot, so I'd have to dig underneath it. Or I could lift. I could. I could raise. Nah, I can't really raise things up. Yes, yeah, so we'll leave that out for now. And then you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead just to kind of reinforce this a little bit. Just kind of do something like that. So that way it just goes bloop, and then hopefully it lands in there. For the most part, I guess you know what? I guess it doesn't really matter. Actually, you know what? It really doesn't matter. What we could do? Let's do this instead. Let's just put these down here. Let's just make ourselves a hole. And then we'll just use um we'll use a magnet stick and just go whoop and stick it into, you know what I mean? Just keep things simple for now. So we've got this crucible, we've got that crucible, we have Yeah, that that'll work. That'll work. Okay, so if I grab a golden nugget. Let me place that on here and we take this guy off and I throw this in here. That didn't go in there, did it? Oh no, it's because it's not on. Uh, okay, so that looks good. And then, oh. Well, let's see if we can just dump this in here. Yeah. So we'll set this guy right there to catch all that stuff again. Go ahead and turn everything on. I probably should throw it. You know what? I really should probably throw another uh, valve. I guess I could just turn these off, but yeah, well. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and split the gold this time. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We don't have a, I need a bin right here. There we go. All right, now we can do it. Shwink. All right, well, we missed like all of that, but that's fine, I guess. Oh my goodness. All right, come on, get in here. And into there, okay, perfect. So now what I can do is I can grab these. And we can magically float into that. What are you doing? What are you doing? You wrenches? I didn't know wrenches were magnetic. That's kind of funny. There. And then we can go ahead and throw this into there. And I missed one. You know what? I'm actually kind of curious. What happens if... Can, can you just use lava to heat that? That'd be kind of cool if you could, I'm not gonna lie. All right, so we get that one going. And then what we can do is we can go ahead and um, throw this in there too. And then we'll swap out for that guy. There's that one, there's that one. And then, boop. Throw that there, grab this guy, grab this. All the iron is in here. That looks pretty good. Grab that, throw that in there, grab this. Toss it into here. Oh my God, of course. You know what? This magnet stick is, is worth its weight in gold, honestly. It really, really is. Oh, there's a bar already in here. Oh, you know what? We can resmelt the bar, it's fine. And then that turned to gold, or that turned to liquid, so there's that. Then we can throw this one on here. Oh, look at our teeny tiny little gold bar. Oh, is that adorable? So then, let's see, what's left in here? Hard stone. We've got some gems. We've got um, the crystal shards. Not doing too shabby. All right, that just finished. Wow, look at that. We actually have a full size. We have a full size iron bar. Amazing. All right, let's go sell those. Let's see how uh, how our profits are working. Yeah, this isn't too, this isn't too terrible. Things are working here. I mean, it's you know it's the first little automation empire that we started here. So yeah, it looks good. All right, I think everything else. Do I need to sell everything else in here? Uh, the gems sometimes are worth some some casholas, but that's fine. Let's just go sell our bars. We finally made some bars. Let's reap the rewards of our efforts. Okay, so our one block of hardstone is worth 80 coins. All right, our one block or of iron is worth 490, and it was a large bar. And our small bar of gold is worth 390. Oh, very nice. Look at that, 800. Wow, we're actually not too, not too shabby. 960, looking good. Awesome. Okay, so I think we are on our way now for uh, the next shop. So I'm actually going to go ahead and grab my hydro tokens that I have here. 
I don't foresee us needing to buy anything more here until the other shop is built. I don't think so. Oh no! I just ran, I ran out of lava. Oh, darn it. Okay, we're good. I had to run all the way, all the way back home to get the lava. So let's go, uh, let's go fill the thing up before we go anywhere. But I want to go back to, uh, I want to go back to the town and see what we need in order to get, um, that tier one shop built. Cause it had, a, I had a couple requirements. I had some iron bars, I think. Um, and it might've had hardstone if I'm not mistaken, it might've had hardstone. So, um, we'll, we'll have to see what's going on with that. Who don't, I don't know what happens if we drive in there. Like, I really, really don't want to find out. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, where did my bucket go? <laughs> oh my gosh. My bucket. Um, I was trying to put, <laughs> I was trying to fill it up <laughs> and I hit the wrong button. So like it just left it floating there, but it, it, it left it floating in my cab. Oh, darn it. And, um, so it, <laughs> I couldn't move. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. One more bucket of lava and this bad boy should be full. And we should be set. Perfect. Okay. Oh no, I just did it. Okay, good. It's on, it's on the, in the back of my truck though. All right. So let's go see what we need for the tier one shop. Whee! Airtime, baby. Let's go. Never knew that these trucks were made for, for airtime, but oh man, not bad. Okay. So tier one shop, we need hardstone block zero of 20 and iron bar zero of 30. Now, does that mean we need a hardstone block that is 20 and a, an iron bar that is 30? Or do we need 30 total equal total iron bar? I think it's 30 total. So we'll go ahead and we'll adjust the hardstone block to 20. So he doesn't make one until we can hit 20 is worse. And then the iron bar, we need 30. So we're going to have to, you know what? We probably should grab the scale. Yeah, we'll grab the scale. That way we can see how close we are to 30. Do I have money in here still? Oh, I do. Wonderful. Is the scale in here? How much is the scale 146 no way hold on a second are you kidding me it's exact i had i had literally exactly enough coins for that that is that no i should go buy a lottery ticket <laughs> oh my gosh that's funny all right back at our little our little our little what do, what do we call this what do we call this plot back at our plot i think so i think a plot is a good good word for that all right so let's go ahead and just set this right there no Right no, right there. Then we'll know uh, how heavy it is. And then let's see, we've got we got a breakdown on this machine here. Probably should go ahead and get some more um, some more filters going. But you know what? That's things we can do the next episode because that next episode because that is gonna end this one. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, subscribe, all the fun things. Uh, we got more of a factory here. It looks like a mess. It's a hot mess, but you know what? It is our mess and it's working. It's doing the things, doing the stuff that we needed to. And uh, yeah, so next episode, we're going to, I think we're going to try to go, oh, hold on, let's go ahead and switch this to 20. Um, 20. Perfect. Okay. Uh, so next episode, I think we're going to go ahead and try to get that tier one shop built. Kind of see what that gives us access to. I'm going to guess it's going to give us access to uh, conveyor belts, but that's going to be a whole separate thing in and of itself. Um, it might actually give us access to, well, actually all the conveyor belts and all the pieces for them. So that would be really nice, but <sighs> lots of things to do still. So. Yeah, but thanks again for coming out. This is the Hydroneer DLC, and if you want to check it out, I'll have a link down below, as always. But yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.